You must have heard about Lambasingi, that beautiful spot on the hills about 125 kilometers from Vizag. Some of us may have already taken that scenic drive between Lambasingi and Chintapalli. If you look out of your car window into the distance, you will notice that many of the hilltops are getting ravaged by mining. The green protective topsoil has been removed and now you can see the ugly rocks underneath. The hills are now full of sound of heavy earth moving equipment and very frequently you hear the big boom of mining explosives echoing through the hills. The once quaint village of Madagonta has become a hot spot of mining activity. There is a study saying that mining spots are surrounded by the worst roads and living conditions. This must be true because when the mining activity went up, the roads became terrible. Tons of clay is extracted from the mines over here, most probably for the ceramic tiles industry. Is this mining legal, you might ask? It's difficult to answer that question. But this area is notorious for illegal mining. These hills are off limits for commercial mining from private parties and is protected under Schedule 5 of the Constitution. Yet mining is rampant here. We must remember that our hills get around 1200 mm of rainfall annually versus only 800 mm in the plains. So we shouldn't fool around with a place that gives us our water. We must keep in mind that more than 50% of our district's landmass is in the Eastern Ghats. On the foothills of these mines, the Adivasis live, do their cultivation and get their water from. During the rains, the topsoil, the dust from the mines all washes down into the fields and also pollutes their drinking water. The lorries carrying away the mine products puts a heavy burden on the roads of the Eastern Ghats. Our Adivasi friends live in an extraordinarily beautiful place and a wonderful ecosystem. You must have heard that the Adivasis did not want bauxite mining in their area. In fact, they don't want any type of mining. They want to live a contented life with little assistance from the government. We must hope that the government understands the situation and that they do not encourage mining of the hills. Save our Adivasi friends. Save the fragile ecosystem of our Eastern Ghats.